Retirees are getting a raise. Hi everyone, I'm Andrew Buza, Manager of Financial Planning with today's Advisor Takeaway. So we'll get the final numbers in October, but based on early estimates, Social Security recipients can expect an 8 to 9% increase to their benefit in 2023. This amounts to roughly an additional $150 a month for the average Social Security beneficiary. So all told, this would actually be one of the largest increases since the program began back in 1935. And here's a really key point. If you are at least age 62 in 2023, you will benefit from the COLA increase even if you haven't yet filed for your benefits. For those retirees who use Social Security to cover a large portion of their expenses, this is a really big deal. Now, an increase in Social Security benefits due to inflation is all well and good, but do keep in mind that we're dealing with a bit of a double-edged sword here in the case of the potential for increase in Medicare premiums. Now, last year, Medicare Part B premiums increased at a rate of over 14%. So just keep in mind that while the Social Security benefits are going up, the potential is the Medicare premiums could eat up some of that increase. Now, fortunately, uh, in the Medicare trustees annual June report, they project that the 2023 Part B premium will stay level. So we hope that that will remain the case. And the Inflation Reduction Act of 2022 aims to continue to assist in that regard. And we've spoken about that in some of our recent content. Keep in mind that this bill uh, will hope to cap Part D premiums uh, once it goes into effect in 2025. And finally, as a parting note, our financial planning software is conservative. So when we do our modeling for Social Security, you know, it's nice to know that in reality, we're getting these large increases to the benefits. But in our modeling, we do try to be more conservative than that. So we're not projecting overly rosy scenarios. And that's it for today's advisor takeaway. Thanks for listening.